Hi Woodlands, I hope everybody is having a wonderful summer. On this week's episode of Crafting with Kara, we're going to learn how to recycle an old soda bottle and turn it into a bird feeder. This is a fun craft that will make your backyard a bird's paradise. All you will need is an empty soda bottle, two wooden spoons, acrylic paint or multi-surface spray paint, scissors, wire or string, paintbrush, and bird seed. First, you're going to take an empty soda bottle and make sure it is clean with warm, soapy water. And then we want to cut slits where we're going to put the spoons. These spoons are going to act as the perch for the birds and where the bird seed is going to fall out onto where they can eat it. So, we're going to want one spoon going one direction with one spoon a little lower going the other. So what you can do, about four inches up from the bottom, about right here, you can pinch the bottle. And you're going to want an adult to help you with this part. And you're just going to make a little slit. And make it a little bigger so that the spoon can go through. Now you're going to make one slit a slightly bigger than the other so that the large part of the spoon will be able to fit. So this side will be the larger side. All right, so we have an opening and you can just test it out by putting it in there so you're good to go. And then you can make an opening directly across from it where the other side of the spoon will go. So like we did the first time, just pinch the bottle. Make a cut with your scissors. Now, as you can see, this slit is smaller than the other one. So we can test it out by putting the spoon through. Like that. So now we're going to do the same thing we just did, but about two inches below so that we could have one going in the other direction. Now that you have all four slits out of the bottle, it is time to paint it any color you like. So, I used some multi-surface spray paint and just spray painted the bottle with this yellow color. And then you can also paint your spoons as well. This is definitely optional, but if you want, you can. So, I've started painting mine already. I used this metallic blue color. So you can set those aside and let dry for a few minutes. Now that your bottle and spoons are dry, you can now put the spoons into the slits that we made before.
and push it all the way up to the large side of the spoon. like that. And now, for the final touches, you can fill the bottle with bird seed to the very top. All right, once you have filled your bottle, you can put a little on the end of the spoon to get the bird started. <laughs> and then you can close it with the lid. And you can use wire or string, tie around and make a handle. And now you have your very own upcycled bird feeder. Happy crafting woodlands and stay tuned for the next episode of Crafting with Kara where we will make DIY paper dahlia flowers to hang on your wall. And don't forget, this summer Woodlands Online is hosting a baby item drive benefiting the Montgomery County Women's Center. You can drop your items off at any of these four locations that you see on the screen. Happy crafting!